Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the power twenty nine in chapter thirty. Chapter thirty is about inductance, electromagnetic oscillations, and、uh, AC circuits. So there we have、uh, the LC circuit. We we call it RC circuit, right? And we have battery, inductor, and、uh, resistor. The three quantity is listed there. And we find at time t equal to zero. The battery is removed from the circuit, and in this case, the current can be V naught divided by R if the battery is zero, right? Even at the time t equal to zero, at this moment, the battery is removed. The current we can consider is as T I naught equals V naught divided by R. Now the current decays with time, right? Since this is R C decay, so we can write it there. I not times this a、uh, decay term, and there is tau is called constant of time, right? So it equal to L divided by R. Now we need to determine the、uh, induced EMF across the inductor, and、uh, find out the greatest epsilon, right? Epsilon values, values. So for this case, we can say for the RC decay, RC circuit, if battery is removed. There is just a resistor and an inductor in the loop, right? This is a Chernoff's first law. So for this loop, we can see the induced EMF. We can write it there, and the minus is I times R. This R is a resistor. We write it there because we know when current goes through the resistor, the voltage will decrease, right? And finally, this loop will come back equal to zero. Uh、mm、huh. -hmm. Now we can write epsilon as the I times R. Input I inside. We can see in which cases this term will reach its maximum. Of course, at t equal to zero, this term just becomes one, right? So now this one becomes to I naught times R. So at t equal to zero initial, this is this maximum induced EMF equal to I naught times R, and this is there back V naught. And V naught is just a twelve volts.